I okay, threw a no. suggestion of uh, Dudley Moore disease out there. Is yeah. it sup supra paranucleic palsy? Is that what it is? Uh, um, in, in, in fact, uh, it, it, if you look at it, it's progressive uh, supranuclear palsy. Nuclear palsy. Okay. And um, it, it, you know, it's mistakenly diagnosed as. Parkinson's or Alzheimer's quite often at the beginning. Yeah. Uh, be because, this, you know, you, you've you got a palsy, uh, so you've got the tremor and rigidity uh, like Parkinson's, and you've got cognitive changes like Alzheimer's. So uh, they're, you know, they're kind of, uh, well, <laughs> uh, uh, it, this is not easily diagnosed at the start, but eventually it becomes quite obvious. Yeah. And, you know, Parkinson's disease is uh, uh, related to a disturbance in, in a, a chemical uh, alpha uh, uh, synuclei. And the progressive supranuclear palsy is a, a tau pathy. Uh, yeah, tau is a substance tau, like Alzheimer's and frontotemporal dementia, while also progressive uh, uh, supranuclear palsy. Uh, so, uh, um, it, uh, thus, it's easily confused there, but um, it, it also goes by some other name, you know, <laughs> like everything in medicine. Um, yeah, yeah, you, know, you you find it kind of popping up in a couple of different spots. Nuchal dystonia, <laughs> and, uh, and my, you know, my pet peeve about people putting their names on things. Yeah, put your well, name on it. <laughs> uh, the, this has. Three people hyphenated together. I guess they had to argue as to who was actually the one who found the syndrome of uh, it's Richardson Steele Oslewski syndrome palsy. Now that should give you a freaking palsy. Uh, and, uh, uh, it gives uh, it it uh, pisses me off when people start to uh, try and claim these things with their name. Uh, the 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 describing this as a progressive uh, supranuclear palsy is an accurate description. You don't have to remember who the hell Richardson or Steele or you know this is as bad as Gunkelman Oslowski. So um, you know, uh, <laughs> but it, so that this this is it's not an easy initial diagnosis, but eventually the the damage ends up. Um, mounting to the point where all of its symptoms kind of come together and it differentiates itself. It's not just the rigidity and palsy. Um, you're, you can't use your eyes properly. Um, uh, and Well, uh, it's a very slow progressing. It's a slow death. And eventually you can't swallow. From what I remember, you can't yeah. swallow anymore. And then you get the feeding tube, and then you get the pneumonia, and then that's it. It's, yeah, uh, they they basically say there's three to five years expectancy uh, from from a full diagnosis. Uh, you know, not from the initial uh, uh, stiffness and palsy. But it, it's not as slow as uh, uh, Parkinson's, uh, uh, right. which has a few more years expectancy beyond that. But uh, um. Uh, it, it it's um, it, it's not quote hereditary, but uh, there the there's a genetic towards the tau pathology. So, uh, but it's not handed down in a family uh, like uh, yeah like some other uh, uh, problems.